It's 2025, and the tech world's biggest headlines aren't coming from Silicon Valley, they're coming from China. China is dropping breakthrough after breakthrough, fundamentally reshaping what's possible in tech. This isn't just about cheaper or faster, it's paradigm-shifting innovation across multiple sectors. From batteries to infrastructure, AI and nuclear power, China is moving at a speed and scale that's hard to match. Next-gen batteries, futuristic infrastructure, dominant AI, and a leap in nuclear power. This isn't just about China, it's about the future of global technology. A new era of innovation is here, and it's happening right now. Let's dive in. Let's start with batteries, the core of modern tech. For years, EV batteries improved slowly, a bit more range, a bit faster charging. But in 2025, China unveiled a solid-state battery that changes everything. These batteries let EVs travel over 1,000 kilometers, about 620 miles, on a single charge. The real breakthrough? Self-healing capability. Microcapsules inside the battery release a polymer to repair cracks and restore performance. Major automakers like BYD and NIO are already integrating this tech. The result? Batteries that last much longer, slashing EV ownership costs. The new global standard isn't just energy density, it's longevity and resilience. Self-healing batteries mean less waste and a huge environmental win. Imagine phones that barely lose battery life after years or grid storage that lasts decades. The center of gravity for battery innovation has shifted to China. The battery revolution is here, and it's made in China. Let's talk infrastructure. China's Huajiang Grand Canyon Bridge, finished in 2025, is the world's tallest, over 2,000 feet above the river. Built in under four years for $300 million, it's a marvel of speed and efficiency. In the West, similar projects can take a decade and cost billions. China's secret, streamlined approvals, top-down planning, and unmatched logistics. The bridge slashes travel time from over an hour to a minute, connecting communities and unlocking trade. China's model, use infrastructure to drive growth, then export that model worldwide. This is soft power in action, changing the global landscape. The age of mega infrastructure has arrived, and China is leading the way. Next, let's look at the digital frontier. The digital story of 2025, China's AI models are now the global favorites. Alibaba's Quen series and other open-source Chinese models are world-class, not just good for China. Companies like Airbnb now prefer these over American options, a shift unthinkable just a year ago. Why? Open Source Freedom While Western firms close off their models, China's tech giants open theirs up. Developers worldwide can inspect, modify, and build on these models, accelerating innovation. For global companies, this means deep customization. AI that fits their needs, not a one-size-fits-all solution. Chinese models excel in multilingual capability, especially Asian languages, a huge advantage for global businesses. By open-sourcing, China crowdsources R&D, building influence and setting new global standards. It's a platform play. China provides the foundation. The world builds on it. This marks a philosophical split Western centralization versus Chinese collaboration. The result? A multipolar AI landscape with real choices and fierce competition. Costs drop, innovation speeds up, and the balance of power shifts. Airbnb's choice signals a new era. Competition based on merit, not nationality. In key areas, Chinese AI isn't just catching up, it's leading. The global AI race is now wide open. The world's best AI? It might just be made in China. And that's changing everything. Let's see how they're powering this revolution. What about the hardware running all this AI? Here's where it gets interesting. U.S. export controls aim to slow China's AI by restricting top-tier chips. Instead, China got creative, focusing on efficiency, not just raw power. Companies like Huawei and DeepSeek now achieve world-class AI performance with fewer, cheaper chips. Constraints bred innovation, smarter software, optimized algorithms, and new system architectures. They're pioneering model optimization and distributed computing, making AI run faster on less powerful hardware. Think mastering aerodynamics instead of just building a bigger engine. Even NVIDIA's CEO admits China's domestic chips are now nanoseconds behind the best. Huawei's Ascend chips and DeepSeek's efficient models are closing the gap fast. The future of AI isn't just about the biggest supercomputer, it's about the smartest algorithms. This lowers barriers and democratizes access to powerful AI. U.S. controls may have accelerated China's push for self-sufficiency, 
China is now mastering software hardware co-design, changing the rules of the game. They're not just catching up, they're redefining the competition. The next leap in AI may come from doing more with less. All this tech, especially AI, demands massive energy. China's answer, a historic bet on nuclear power. While the West slows or phases out nuclear, China is building more reactors than the rest of the world combined. They're not just building more, they're building better. In 2025, China launched the world's first commercial thorium reactor, safer, more abundant, and less wasteful than uranium. Thorium reactors, long a Western dream, are now a Chinese reality. China is also pushing hard on nuclear fusion, setting world records with projects like the East Tokamak. Billions are pouring into fusion research, aiming for the ultimate clean energy source. This nuclear push is strategic, powering AI, manufacturing and the entire digital economy. Abundant, cheap, clean energy makes data centers and factories more cost-effective. China is building the energy foundation for tomorrow's industries, today. While others debate, China acts, solving the energy trilemma, with nuclear secure, affordable, and zero carbon. This could be China's biggest long-term advantage. Their energy strategy lets them scale tech without breaking the grid or the climate. The world's future industries may run on Chinese nuclear power. As others hesitate, China builds. The energy race is on and China is pulling ahead. The synergy between tech and energy is reshaping the global landscape. Let's bring it all together. Put it all together, self-healing batteries, mega infrastructure, open source AI hardware efficiency and nuclear power, and the picture is clear. China isn't just catching up, in key areas it's setting the pace. Each breakthrough fuels the next, creating a powerful feedback loop. The West debates, China builds. This isn't about winners and losers, it's about a new, multi-lane tech race. The era of single superpower innovation is over, a more competitive, dynamic and unpredictable era has begun. The future's being rewritten, in real time.